Hey there, I'm David. I'm Jordan. And this is DJ Daddy Style. That is right. That is right. And we are here once again to talk to our YouTube subscribers and anybody else who wants to join in yeah. about our families. I have a family. My wife's name is Sam. My two kids are named Noah and Mayel. Yep. And uh, my wife is Allison, uh, four-year-old uh, Annabelle, two-year-old Josiah, and one-year-old Joshua. And we are very happy with our families. Yes. We, we love our families very much, and we, when we love something, we just want to talk about it. And that's right. so that's what we're here to do. We're <laughs> here to talk about our families and hopefully be a little bit of encouragement. So what we're doing today is we're going to show you a little bit of, uh, of a trip that we took. Yeah. We went down to Grand Forks, North Dakota, yep. which for us is down because we're, we're just outside of Winnipeg here. So um, we, we took a trip down to North Dakota and we went to Walmart. And uh, so we want to just show you a little bit about what we did at Walmart, yeah. some of the things that, uh, that we were looking for, and the weird conversations that we got into while we were there. It was, it was a fun trip. It yes. was a fun trip, yes. yeah. And I'm sure we'll talk a little bit more about it, but here's our trip to Walmart. Okay, we are in Walmart. Why are we in Walmart? Because this is what we do. We go to Walmart. Because this is the exciting part of our day, is going to Walmart. I go to Superstore and Costco. Yeah. Well, look, look at the excitement <laughs> on the kids' faces. <laughs> you can Prices. see the, the great amount of excitement on their faces right now, so I'll even bring you see, look, look at me. Look at me, she's all happy. Hey, Mayel, are you excited to be in Walmart? Okay, we're going this way. We're going this way. All right. We're going to spend money. They're going to buy groceries and we're going to spend money. So they're going to spend money. And well, we're going to spend money on fun stuff. Okay, but I'm going to spend money. On yeah, fun like stuff. I'm probably not going to spend any money right now, but. <laughs> I guess that's just the whole thing. I need inflatable mattresses, which it looks like is here. That was quick. <laughs> See, it's the skill. That's what it is. Skill. Skirt. The bucks is what I want. <sighs> See, I'm very frugal. I, uh, I always check the sales and I will buy something and I'll just return it if I find something else that's somewhere else. So I always am buying and then returning, basically. Is that an Aussie quality? No, that's uh, I want to save money for my family, my quality. <laughs> so right now we're in Walmart in the States uh, to see if they sell mattresses uh, for camping. And so they do. Any cheaper than, uh, let's say, Apple Superstore or uh, Canadian Daddy, Tire on Daddy. sale. And uh, at this point, yes, the answer is yes, except they don't have any twins, they just have queens. Well, that's garbage. So, uh, Daddy, Daddy, yeah. Daddy. So we'll keep looking. Yeah. Yes, my son. Here's the deals. Oh, for a buck. For a buck. So you know what you do with this? Mm. You break it down, you dismantle it. Okay. And you put it into an Altoids tin, an empty mint tin, and you can create a solar charger for your iPhone. Right here. Really? This here. That's all. You, that's what you're looking for. Yeah, man. But when I go hiking, huh? Because I haven't been hiking in like ten years. We just passed the pool section, and uh, I believe this year we're not going to set up our pool. Really? Three little ones. It's a bit. Uh, this our number two here. Who's two? Two and three. We're a bit scared that uh, number two will climb in there without us knowing, because you know now we're split. We're outnumbered. Yeah. Okay, I got to check my list here because I like making lists. You have a list. This list was like three times as big. I want like the hiking section or the camping section, not hiking. So I'm planning on going hiking in a couple of months on the Manterio Trail with a friend and you have to provide your own water basically, like be able yeah. to purify it. So that's what I'm looking at now. Can you return something to Walmart in Canada if you buy it in Walmart in America? Like I have no idea. What about you viewers? <laughs> <laughs> this is a good price for a filtration system, but Hmm, I don't know. Ooh, prepare this kit. For the uh for the uh upcoming zombie apocalypse. Ah yes. Yes. I'm surprised they don't advertise that. They do sometimes. Do sometimes. they? Things like this, they'll be advertised as like zombie. But this is my idea of the zombie apocalypse. Because everybody's talking about it, what they're gonna do when it happens. So here's my idea, and I actually kinda stole it from somebody, so I don't think this is plagiarism, but it might be Costco. Thank you. 
go inside of the Costco, make sure it's all cleaned out, well, the oven, zombies, or anything like that, and like, like lock down everything because you will live for years, forever. Forever. for years in Costco, and you won't have to worry about a thing. That's my idea. Yeah, I've heard that before. Yeah, something like that. Okay, so there's gonna be a bunch of us yeah. in Costco. Yeah, yeah. But there's a bunch of Costco's and Sam Clubs and yeah, that's all true. Other that's true. Things. So it'll it'll all work out in the end. Yeah. Or just go to the country because you're always, you know, seeing the zombie apocalypse movies that are all like in the city and stuff like that. Just you know, go to the country. And well, you get a head start because they, the they zombies won't eat all the population in the cities first. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and then you, you know, it's not like they're gonna come on out to the country or anything. They, just, they won't be like, oh, there's one in the country. Because <laughs> that's how they sound. <laughs> Twenty for fifteen bucks. So a twin for 15 bucks at Walmart, is that going to be a better quality and a better investment than a twin for 23 bucks at uh, Canadian Tire? I don't know. I'm probably betting on Canadian Tire, actually. Yes, and the people that are in the States that are looking at us saying, what is Canadian Tire? <laughs> it's a superstore. Is It has everything. Would you like me to tell you what it has? Please. It has automotive, camping, fishing, hockey, Tools, kitchens, stuff like pots and pans and uh, stuff. And they even have two liters of pop. Has two liters of pop? Yep. Okay. Uh, shelving. Oh, don't forget the candy. Candy, shelving, knives, fishing rods, guns. Ah, uh, ammunition. Ammunition. Gotta have ammunition. Yeah. I don't have a gun, but. And you did mention hockey, but we'll mention hockey. it again because. Swimming pools. Yeah. Yep. Basically a one stop shop for everything. Yeah. And they always have good sales. So it's equivalent, I'd say, to like a Target. Mix a Target with a Walmart, with a Cabela's. Minus the groceries. Minus the groceries. And the fudge. Yeah. Because Cabela's has pretty sweet fudge. It does, and it's free for a trial, and that's what makes it so good. We were talking <laughs> about zombie apocalypses before, and I've just seen Targets here, if you just choo. Mm -hmm. And uh, so we were in Menards the other day, and my two-year-old, starts pointing and he's like, Grandad, grand Grandpa, Grandpa, Grandpa. And I'm like, what, you want to buy that for Grandpa? And I couldn't work out what it was, right? So I finally go through everything, this, no, this, no, this, no. And I'm like, and I hold up this target and it's a picture of a zombie. And he's like, yeah, that looks like Grandpa. <laughs> I told Grandpa. <laughs> I'm sure he appreciated it. He loved it, yeah. So, okay, uh, dating. Make sheets and stuff? We need new sheets. Because I have kind of dry feet and uh, my feet basically destroy a sheet. It takes a year and I get a rip at my feet. Your feet destroy the sheet? Yeah. So uh, I got to buy a new sheet. All right. Yeah, so uh, that was a good fun catch up. Um, we were actually on a, on a bit of a vacation with uh, my wife's parents, uh, family time, and uh, Dave and his family were uh, coming down for a uh, their own little family time, right? And we were like, hey, let's do lunch and let's go shopping. And we uh, went to Ruby Tuesday we did, and that had a great. Sunday buffet. Yes, that was wonderful. Yes, they had these like, the cinnamon buns were like this big. Yeah. And, oh. I had like four. Yeah. That was bad. They were so good. They were good. Yeah. yeah. So you, you ended up getting, uh, I know one of the things that we were looking at was uh, was the mattress, the air mattresses. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I, uh, I actually had four other air mattresses that I bought, so I took six, and we only need four, right? Because I'm like, well, what happens if one pops, right? So I actually had them all camping with us, which was lucky, because I opened up one of the ones from Walmart, and there was a rip. It was like an inch and a half long, just completely brand new out of the box. So um, someone would have had a really bad sleep if I hadn't have been prepared. But yeah. I was a Boy Scout as a, yes. as a kid. And, What's uh, the thing? Yeah, it's it's three fingers. It's yeah. dib 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 dub dub dub, and uh, yeah, I'm prepared. So <laughs> we <laughs> were lucky. <laughs> dib dib dib. Yeah, dub, I don't dub, know. Dub. It was, I don't know if that's an Australian scout thing or a British, but uh, dib 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 dub dub dub. I don't know. It's, uh, it's a, I don't know, greeting or something. Yeah. Anyway. Okay. Next. Next. <laughs> anyway, um, you also you also were looking at that water filtration system. Yeah. Yeah. I almost never buy anything without like hundred hours of research into it and it was on the spot and you know I don't have wife I don't have uh, you know 3g on my cell phone in, in America right and I couldn't research it so it was a bit of a risky uh, purchase um, but I got home and uh, everyone's reviews are awesome on it it will purify a million gallons of water I mean 
That's impressive. You couldn't beat that, so uh, yeah. I haven't got to try it yet because uh, we haven't gone hiking yet because the bugs are too bad. They are. They're ridiculous. Yeah. They're crazy this year, and so. uh, <laughs> it, that, I guess that's just what happens for where we live. Yeah. But, uh, lots of rain, lots of bugs. Yeah. That, that was our Walmart trip, yeah. and we, we thought we'd share that with you just because, you know, we wanted to wanted to show you that, that we're regular people. We're regular regular dads, just like, you know, some of the dads that are watching us, and, you know, so, there's some moms that are out there, but we're regular, but just not like moms, because we're dads. Because we're dads, yeah. Because we're dads. Yeah. But, um, yeah, if, if you're enjoying what you're watching and you haven't subscribed yet yep. please subscribe because we want to know we want to know who's watching we yep. want to know that there are people watching and so if uh, if you want to leave comments if you want to uh you know tell your story to us we're cool yeah. with that you know yeah. like we the whole point of this isn't just us talking to you nope. it's a communicative thing you know yeah. it's something that we we want to hear from you guys and so another thing is our facebook yep um, we have a Facebook page. We have a Facebook page. If that you... was me trying to throw it to Jordy yeah. there. We're I'm still working slow. out some kinks. If you want to join our Facebook page, uh, then we're just going to post some random articles every now and then. Um, some parenting stuff, some dad stuff, I don't know, whatever. And, uh, and we'll also be posting when the uh, videos are up and, uh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, so you know, we have our social media, we do have our Twitter, I won't get into that mistake again. Yeah. Um, my Twitter, if you've seen it already, is basically just a retweet, or a repost of the stuff that I do on Facebook. Mm. So anybody that doesn't do Facebook but does Twitter can still get the same sort yeah. of thing. So that's, that's what I do with mine. Mine's a ghost town. Yeah, basically, but uh, that, that's, that's what we do. And so, um, subscribe, like us on Facebook do all that social media stuff that's kind of his department because i'm kind of not smart when it comes to those things but he's he's the uh, he's the social media man yeah if you have any videos that you want us to do please ask us yeah do a video a, a reply and we'll reply back to you or uh yeah we we want some ideas you know we have some ideas that we've got and we're yeah. working on them but we want to know what you want yeah yeah you know i've seen some people do these things where they they have like a list a list of uh, of questions that their viewers have asked them, mm. and so if we get if we get enough uh, enough questions, then maybe we'll just do a, a DJ Daddy style sure. question and answer thing. Um, but that's that's basically all we have. But I did want to mention one thing. There's one more little video clip clip that I wanted to show in our Walmart adventure. Oh, cool. um, yeah. I don't know if you know about this one, but uh, we you saw we were we were rolling around, and Jordy had those those dollar. Uh, solar lights. Mm. Now we we put those in the cart, and all throughout, and I kind of cut a mo most of it out, but the majority of the time, uh, his uh, his boy Josiah was sitting there smashing this thing against the cart and yes, breaking it, and it was falling apart. And so I still um, bought them. I did still buy them. That's good. Yeah. But I, I I was I was asking Jordy a little bit uh, on the video. I, I asked him, you know, like how how do you deal with that when your kids are just doing something that uh, you know they shouldn't be doing and uh, here's what Jordy had to say. Sometimes there's a difference between like caring and just saying no don't do that because you, you should. But, uh, <laughs> yeah, we'll leave it at that. Please don't tell my wife.